method of posting in a standard ledger account number one endeavor to trace the ledger account in which the entries are to be posted another point to know is if an account is debited in general journal it will be posted on the debit side of the ledger account but if it is credited in the general journal it will be posted on the credit side number three point to note is in the description colon the title two that is the name of the account included in the other parts of the journal for example when posting an account included in the journal entries debit part the account in the credit part will be written in the description column number four point to know it the amount of the entry it must be written in the amount colon of the ledger account how to balance a ledger account balancing of a ledger account is literally means finding out the debit or credit balance of a ledger account this process entails the following steps let's take number one there is a need to total the debit and credit sides of the account after totaling the debit and credit side the next thing to do is which is number two is calculate the difference between the two totals found in the previous step Number three point to note is put the difference on the lighter side, that is the less earlier side in the financial transaction. After that, elaborate on the third point, which is the lighter side. Put the difference so placed in the place of the account. Number fifth point to know is if the debit side of the account is heavier than the credit side, the account is said to have a debit balance. In case the credit side of the account is heavier than the debit side, the account is said to have a credit balance. However, if the totals of the two sides of the account are equal, the balance will be zero. After the T format, the second format is safe balancing format. In the previous, in the standard format of a ledger account, the balance is not stated after each transaction. In an organization where account balances are required after each transaction, the self balancing or running balances format of a ledger is very important in this type of organization. The main advantage of this ledger account format is, is that it shows the current balance at a, at a simple glance. The banks and other financial institutions are good example of business organizations that use this type of self balance account ledgers.